In this video, I'd like to show you a few facts about password management in Microsoft Edge. So uh, I'm going to log into a Gmail account here. So let's go ahead and do that. And what's going to happen is Microsoft Edge will offer to save the password. All right. Which, of course, I am lying. Nope, there it is. All right. So I can go ahead and click on save and that will save it uh, in the browser so that the next time I log in, I don't have to remember the password, right? So let's see where that password is stored. So if we click on these three little dots in the upper right hand corner and go down to settings, we have under profiles on the left here we have passwords right and under saved passwords of course we have our saved password now you can view your passwords right if you if you have saved your password and have forgotten it you can click on this little eye next to any of the pass any of the passwords and it will prompt you for your windows password just to make sure that a stranger can't come and review your stuff, right? So that you um, are the only one that is supposed to know your Windows password. You type in your Windows password and you will actually see the password itself. Uh, for security purposes, of course, I'm not actually going to show that. So um, suffice it to say that you can view them, right? And then there's also uh, a little three dot menu prompt here where you can click on details which again will show you um, the password details etc url and everything for uh, the saved password or you can delete it right and deleting of course is handy if you just feel that you've uh, made things not secure enough by saving passwords for certain things i don't recommend of course that you save passwords for things like your bank paypal anything that deals with money Right. This would be more for, you know, uh, accounts that aren't so dangerous and, and accounts where people can't start stealing your identity with information they find there should they break into your browser and steal all your passwords. Right. So um, and also they have some other options here. Um, the main one being offer to save passwords. Right. And. You can turn that off if you find the prompt annoying all the time. You just don't want to save any passwords. Or um, if you know you want to save a particular password, you can always come in, turn it on, then go log in, have the password saved, and then come back here and turn it off. And that way you only get prompted when you want, right? And then they have a sign in automatically option, right? And as they note, if this is turned off, we'll ask you for permission every time before signing into a website. So um, leaving that on, of course, for some sites will just automatically log you in. You won't even have to think about it, right? Um, that won't work for everything, I think, but for the ones that it does work for, um, you may find it very convenient. But naturally, turn that off if you don't want that to be happening. 